out. I set a rec new record at a marathon. Today are totally great for reading fortunes, Mike. Right, Michael? Yeah, speaking of fortunes, let's check to see if we have a special visitor in the top. Okay. Chip, the tourney was so much fun. I could truly can't wait for the next one. Yeah, this is the guy who hosts the fishy tourney. And we take a look inside, and we're going to see. Uh, I think they are they going to have the announcement who wins. Nope. Well, that sucks. I was actually kind of curious to see who won. I think it's probably going to be on the bulletin board. Yeah, every time the fishing tourney, Chip will be here. And there's one thing for the summer as well, which we'll get to that when they announce it. And now as we approach the third and final storm of the Stormy Marathon. Oh, ooh, and aw, oh, that's her two evils. Dina, I thought you pulled it out. Aw, I was hoping we were going to get a double. But nope, we're just gonna have to settle with one. And. Ooh, I'm actually kinda curious what happens. Oh, we're gonna have to wake her up. Oh no, was I sleeping just now? How embarrassing. I haven't been enough getting enough rest lately. Let's talk to you. Hello again. Can I help? Woo! -hoo. Living alone can get, well, kind of lonely. <laughs> but friendly neighbors. Got that right. And now. Can we play the xylophone? Yes, we can! So we can get, we get Dina to clap more! And one more for good measure. Whoops, and one more for good measure. Ah, oh, screw it. Let's do one more. Thank you, Dina. Good to see you. As we approach that midnight hour, and Roscoe, you're still shaking that tree. What are you doing, Nay? You heard about shaking trees to get feet before, right? Fruit on it. Sometimes one of your furniture will fall out of the branches. I know, crazy, but you should give it a try. Just be aware of it. Be careful. Okay. That's good to note, Roscoe. We got 11,000. I have enough, but let's be honest, I need more money. And... Alright, let's see who won. Blue Bear won, rolled second, Angus third. They all caught a horse mackerel. And I love that Roscoe is reading in the bulletin board. Oh, rolled, buddy! Hey, Michael. I played hard today, but buddy, sweat level? Hot pot from that day. <laughs> what a gag with you. Ugh, rumors can be frightening. The other day I heard a story that was full of semi incorrect info. I'm a prince of another. <laughs> oh, rolled. I never want you to leave. Fudge is nowhere to be found. Cambrera's home. And there's her. Is anyone else home? Hans is home. 
but Angus is not. But Angus is not. Either way, let's visit Canberra first, then we'll visit Hans. Alright, let's visit Hans. I mean Canberra. Oh, it's Michael. I got the sun nerds to spruce up. I said you were coming. So, uh, thanks, I guess. Uh, uh, Canberra, we don't need to be tutorials. Okay, again, she's doing a lot of tutorials. Yeah, pretty much Canberra's being Miss Tutorial today. What a shock, huh? No, let's just hope Pons isn't much of a Mr. Tutorial. Let's see what Hans is up to. I was hoping you'd drop by my place. It's even better with you in it. So what's up, Ruby? The common share is a cool... Okay. That was a nice conversation with Hans. And we're gonna have to find Angus. But knowing him, he's probably in the museum. Or he's probably around... Oh, wait. Oh, that was a fruit tree. Anka's home, so let's say hello to her. Then we have to find Angus and Pudge. How else we have you to visit, Michael? What would we like to talk about? I don't know if you believe in luck, Michael, but I sure do. There are certain items I know are lucky. I have one to carry around all the time, I just... I did your eye color. Hmm, I don't know about that, Anka. So let's, as we get closer, as we look at the time... Whoops. Four minutes to midnight, so once again for the second time in this... Only the second or third time in the series. Oh, oh, there's Angus. Let's talk. But uh, I'm gonna Alex Green. Wait, you just gave it to me. Don't get too excited. I could see Angus. You have a pretty good option. I don't want. I probably won't. Ah, oh, well, Angus, I know you're just joking. Oh, wait. Maybe he wasn't, and I have to pay for it. Shout. Alright, so I guess we know who's at the museum by default. It's Pudge. So, let's head on over. Alright, let's go find you, Pudge. I know you're probably in here. Um, Pudge? Pudge, buddy old pal. Man, this could be the fourth episode in a row we haven't seen Pudge. Hmm. 
Hmm. Let's check the other rooms in the museum. He's probably going to be in there. Let's check the bug room. Who knows? Maybe Pudge may be in here. I'll be really, really surprised if Pudge shows up in here. Nope, no dice. Alright, he's gotta be in the... He's gotta be in here. If not, then... He's probably asleep. Ah, keep playing, keep playing. If I hit the select button, yep, it's officially midnight, guys. Yep, Pudge is probably asleep. Unless Pudge is in that other room where you, where you get from Art. From Art. From Red, excuse me, not Art. What am I saying? Because I'm a stupid idiot. Who knows, Pudge may be in here. Love the music that plays in here, by the way. Nope. No dice. No dice once again. Alright guys. I think it's time to head back to the house. And. Get ready to sign off. NHL will be. Also today tomorrow. With some, this, with some mix of this. As well. Looks like Dina just went to bed. I'm sleepy right now. Come back in the morning. There's that. So which means now. The villagers are starting to fall asleep now. Anka's is still awake. Oh. What? Got it. First bug. Which is a... Dung beetle. Now nah, the joke is just too easy. Oh, I can't do anything about it. Onda still awake. Cambrera still awake. By the way, let's take a look at Pudge's house. Does he say he's asleep? <laughs> he is asleep. I'm sleepy. Please don't wake me up, okay? But. Rolled. I'm in a deep sleep. Come wake me up later. Okay. Yep, there you guys go. Everyone's starting to fall asleep. All the villagers are starting to fall asleep. Well, at least I got Dina to clap three times. And Roscoe! No, Michael, 
They're looking good, and they open the love up. I said it again. Probably spent a while back. I say nay a lot. Should I try something else? Yeah, it's time for a change. So I screwed that. Alright, he's letting me decide. Okay. Learn something good. Alright. Whoops. Ah, oh, I was gonna say day at the races. You know what? I'm just gonna say derby. That's what we're gonna do. Derby. Hmm, is that that's it? Nailed it. Derby. Derby. Yeah, that's not too bad. I knew you could do it, Michael. Thanks. I'm gonna take it out for a test drive. I'm pretty sure I just found my new thing, Derby. My style's so tasty now, I wouldn't be surprised that someone tried to take a bite out of me. Gah! Ah, oh, Roscoe. Whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh. whoa. Another dung beetle. Yeah, all of our villagers are soon to start falling asleep. Now it's Blue Bear. Yes, she is. Oh, she's still playing. Really? Really? No fooling. Blue Bear is still playing. Well, that's it, guys. I will be trying to get more daylight episodes in. But tonight, time to wrap things up. Everyone's turning in. I think I'll be turning in as well. But right, so next time on Animal Crossing New Leaf, we're going to hopefully get a full day in. Thanks for but Good night, guys. Sweet dreams. See you guys later on today for the next episode.